As an administrator or manager of a care home, you need to teach your staff about the safety procedures already established and required by state fire and health agencies. All care homes must have an emergency plan. The plan includes an emergency evacuation map, emergency equipment, and procedures. The plan identifies the roles and responsibilities of staff. You have tools in the home to help protect yourself and residents. Remember, big fires start small. The fire extinguisher you walk by every day can stop a small fire before it becomes a big fire. Take the time to learn how to use it. The smoke alarms and pull alarms that are located throughout your care home will alert you of a possible fire and give you valuable time to react and evacuate if needed. These alarms do not automatically call the fire department. You'll have to call 911 yourself. Check the date on smoke alarms. If the smoke alarm is 10 years or older, it should be replaced. Replace batteries at least once a year, if not sooner. Test smoke alarms monthly. In some cases, fire sprinklers are required. Sprinklers will buy you the most time to evacuate the home. Locate the evacuation map posted in your care home. It will show you at least two direct exits out of the house. Practice evacuating out of both exits. It's a good idea to mark the meeting place that's outside in front of the care home. Know where the fire doors are and how they work. Identify them on your evacuation map. Fire doors are solid core doors with a smoke gasket at the top and each side. When properly closed and latched, the fire door adds time to allow you to get out of the house. Keep wheelchairs and other needed equipment with the residents and available. Maintain emergency contact information for all residents, care home administrators, and emergency agencies. Keep a copy in a safe electronic format for access after evacuating. There are additional steps you will need to take if you are instructed to evacuate out of your neighborhood. For instance, you should prepare a go kit in advance for each resident. These kits should be kept in an easily accessible area and should stay with the resident during an evacuation out of the neighborhood. The kit contains clothing, food and water, medical supplies, and your emergency plan. Introduce yourself to your neighbors. Okay. I've been meaning to come over and introduce myself. Tell them about your residential care home. Introduce yourself to the police. Introduce yourself to the fire department, as well as local community emergency response teams. They should be aware of your care home location before an emergency happens. We encourage everyone to take the time to practice evacuating. Practice with other staff or able adults. Trade off role playing so that you will understand what it's like to be the resident. During drills, you may discover things that block access or problems taking residents out of the home. Do your best to correct these problems as you can. Know where your meeting place is. Let's review. Learn about the life safety tools already in place. Test your smoke alarms. Change batteries at least once a year or sooner. Learn how and when to use a fire extinguisher. Fire sprinklers give you the most time to get out. Know how you will evacuate. And know at least two different ways out of the house. Know where your meeting place is. Meet your neighbors. They may be the first available to help in an emergency. Introduce yourself to local emergency response agencies and volunteers.